Hi, my name is Dorian, uh, and this is my wife, Sydney. And about three years ago, I was a senior in college when the Moore campaign started. It was something that I really wanted to get into. I was a little unsure how exactly it would work. Having this idea of what I was going to give to the campaign on a consistent basis was a little hard for me. I want to give, but I also want to make sure that I'm going to be covered. Getting to the decision, it took a decent amount of having conversations with the people in my church family. Hey, this is where I'm at financially. This is what I'm giving. I just don't see how these two are going to add up or how these two are going to align. You also have to recognize that we're not trusting in our finances on this. We're trusting it with God and we're trusting with the plan that he has for it. And if we're going to take that willing step of faith, even though when we can't 100 percent fully see it, he honors that. And going into that opened up a lot of doors for me just in that very own motive. I was able to get a full time job offer that was closer to home. So I wasn't driving an hour to work and then driving an hour home. And then on top of that, we got married, which was wonderful. It's just been so wonderful seeing how all of that has kind of culminated just in the midst of this campaign on its own. I didn't know this, but Dorian had actually put it on his vision sheet that year to buy a house. It didn't make sense finance wise how we were going to make it work, but we just started casually looking. We toured a couple of homes and we'd put an offer in on two of them. I was prompted by the Holy Spirit to check Zillow just one more time. And so I checked it and I found this house and I was like, something about this house. I just I don't know what it is. And so I woke Dorian up out of a dead sleep <laughs> and I said, hey, we have to go tour this house. We spent over an hour at that house and we were just like, this is it. Like, this is our house. The following day, we got um, a text from a realtor saying, hey, you're about to enter into contract. And in that time, again, it didn't make sense as to how it was going to happen. The finances like budget was in the red, didn't make sense at all. But now we're in this home and we're working on renovating it, making our own. And it's just been amazing. We host the teens twice a month. We host the young adults about once a month in our home. During the campaign, too, I mean, we got I got a new car. You got two job promotions. I think I had two or three job promotions. We got the house. Yep. I was in faith for a PC and was able to get a PC. I think on top of just this entire process, it's helped so much just in the ministries and the different things that we lead. In a way, we're able to take the same story that we had and the same faith journey that we had and help break it down for others people. Being vulnerable in our faith journey and growing in our faith journey has really allowed us to be able to minister yeah. to a lot of people our age, younger, yes. and. Now we're like, how do we get around to the people that are in the yeah. next season of life so that we can glean from them and learn from them in their faith journey? Going through this entire process of the campaign has done so much for my faith journey. It's given me a better way of just believing for more. The one thing I'm believing for is a, is a new car. And in years prior, that would have been hard for me. But going through this entire campaign has been just a floodgate of helping us understand just how not only the kingdom works, but also where we can put our faith at. If God is willing to give us a house, mm -hmm. if God is willing to give me a PC, which I've desired for years, what is he not willing to give? Right. Anything and everything I can dream for and put my faith towards, that, but that's important. Any opportunity that we can give or sow into or just bless somebody, we're looking for it because it's, it's going to be multiplied and given back to us. Yes. And that's like, this is why it's important.